How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Riley here. And today you guys yet again, yes, I am bringing you all another brand new NBA video right here on my channel. And today you guys, yes, we are coming at you with another brand new quiz as you can already see on the screen right here. And today we are coming at you with one that we have not done yet before and it is an NBA can you guess the team that this certain player never played for? Now I know it seems interesting and a little bit confusing from the title right off the bat, but it's very easy to explain. Simply they are going to be giving us 50 15 different names we have seven total minutes to go through this entire quiz and with each player they give us they're going to give us an option of four different teams and with those four teams you guys we have to go through each of them and decide which one of those four teams that specific player did not play for so yeah that's really the only rule you need to know it is very self-explanatory and there's not much else to it other than that and as i already said we have seven minutes to knock it out so we are going to have plenty of time to get through it but you guys before we actually hop into the video i just want to say that if you guys are brand new viewers to my channel or you guys are coming from a previous video and you have not done this yet for some reason. Please, you guys, I'm highly encouraging each and every one of you to stop this video right now and make sure to go down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Trust me, you guys are not going to regret doing this. I absolutely promise you guys that it's free, it's easy, and to top it off, it just gets you guys my content that much faster than just coming around and checking my channel every now and then. So, you guys, while you are down there, make sure to hit that push notification bell right next to the subscribe button. That way, you guys get updates and notifications on your phone or computer instantly when I post a brand new video. So, yes, you guys, it is a win-win-win situation and if you do do this for me i really appreciate it believe me on that so i think any of you guys who do do this for me but without further ado let's jump into this quiz and see if we can name the team for 15 different players that they did not actually play for all right you guys and clearly i have not played this quiz yet as that would completely defeat the purpose of this video but we have started the timer right now we got seven minutes left 15 different players and we're starting off with jamal crawford now with jamal crawford i know he played for the bulls i know he played for the warriors i know he did at some point in his career I'm not too sure about the Trailblazers. I mean, don't get me wrong. I could be wrong when I say that, but I'm feeling that it's between the Portland Trailblazers and the Cleveland Cavaliers with this one. And with this one, you guys, I'm not sure if it's going to be like this with every one, but I'm not confident in the final two. I'm going to go shot in the dark here. I, I don't think he played for Cleveland. I'm going to say that straight up, and he did not. All right, we got the first one correct. He did not play for the Cleveland Cavaliers, so we are one for one so far. Bam, just like that. Now we are on to Tyson Chandler. And with Tyson Chandler, I'm honestly... I know he played for Dallas, and I know he played for Chicago, and I'm pretty sure, don't get me wrong on this, I am pretty sure he played for the Charlotte Bobcats at one point in his career. Could be wrong there, but I'm pretty sure when he went to the Lakers, that was the first time he had played for an LA team in his career. I actually remember hearing about that in one of the games I watched as he signed with them this year after he got bought out by the Phoenix Suns, so we are going to go with the Clippers in this one, and we are correct on that one as well. All right, process of elimination, simple as that. Two for two, now we are on to Lou Williams. I know Lou Williams played for the Hawks. I know he played for the Sixers. Portland or Toronto? I, I don't think he's ever played in Portland. I don't think, and I'm correct. All right, I'm correct. He never played in Portland. I don't remember seeing Lou Williams in a Portland jersey at all in my career. I honestly don't remember him seeing in a Toronto one as well. I'm going to be honest on that. But when looking at Toronto and Portland, Portland seemed like the more odd one out for Lou Williams. So that seemed like an easy one for me. I don't know. It just clicked in my mind just like that. We are three for three so far. And now we are moving on to Matt Barnes. We got five minutes left. We should probably hurry up a little bit. And with Matt Barnes, I know he played for the Lakers. I know he played for the Magic. Between the Suns and the Mavericks, I don't think he played for the Suns. Oh my god, okay. Alright, there's one wrong. There's one wrong. Apparently, Matt Barnes played for the Mavericks, and I don't remember that, honestly. I'm going to be straight up with that. But that one is on me. Now we are on to Ish Smith, and with this one... I'm going to be honest with this one too, you guys. I have no idea. I have no idea. I know he played for the Pistons. I know he played for the Sixers. I'm almost positive he played for the Sixers, I should say. But between the Suns and the Hawks, I'm... I picked the Suns on the last one. I'm wrong. I'm going to go with the Hawks in this one. And we are correct. All right. That's perfect. That is perfect. We are five for six right now. Not too bad. We got four and a half minutes left. We are under Richard Jefferson. I know he played for the Nuggets. I know he played for the Bucks. I'm going to go. He didn't play for the Spurs. And it's the Rockets. Wow. All right. Richard Jefferson played for the Spurs. I did not know that either. All right. We got two wrong so far. Now we are on to Andre Iguodala. I should know this one as he is a more recent player. We got Denver. We got Golden State. We got Atlanta. And we got Philly. I'm thinking... He did not play for Atlanta, and that one is correct. All right, awesome. We are on to Damari Carroll now. We are 5 for 7 so far. Damari Carroll played for the Hawks. He played for the Nets. I'm pretty sure he played for the Grizzlies. I'm pretty sure he played for the Grizzlies. So we're going to go Pacers, and we are correct with that one. All right, perfect. We are about halfway through the quiz right now. We are 6 for 8. We only got 3 minutes left. I should say 4 minutes left. We got to hurry up with this one. We got Dwight Howard now. We got Clippers. We got Hornets. We got Magic. We got Hawks. This one... 
He never played for the Clippers. That is a no-brainer. That is an obvious one. He definitely never played for the Clippers. Everyone should know that, or at least I do for that matter. So, now we are on to Darren Collison. We got the Mavs. We got the Clippers. We got the Pacers. And we got the Timberwolves. You guys, I'm going to be straight up with this one. I don't know what Darren Collison is. This quiz is actually a lot harder than I thought because we're going off more middle-of-the-pack players and older players. So, for this one, I want to say he didn't play for Dallas or Minnesota. I mean, I'm going to go Minnesota. And I'm correct. All right, perfect. Perfect. We went with Minnesota. Shot in the dark. We got it. Now we are on the Marcin Gortat. I'm thinking I'm going to know this one. He played for Washington. He played for Orlando. I'm almost positive. I don't think Marcin Gortat ever played for the Brooklyn or the New Jersey Nets. And he did not. All right. There we go. We're 9 for 11 right now. We got four left. We got James Johnson. I know he played for Chicago. I know he played for Chicago. He definitely played for the Heat. To the Spurs and the Raptors. There's no way James Johnson has ever played for the Spurs. There is no way. That one is another obvious one. We got Evan Turner now. Now, I know he played for Boston. I know he played for Philly. I know he's on Portland right now. So that leaves one out. Process of elimination. It is the Sacramento Kings. We are down to two and a half minutes, and we got two questions left. All right, so we can take our time now. We can actually take our time on these. Now we got Al Farouk Aminu. And for this one, this is going to be another tough one, you guys. I'm not too positive on Al Farouk Aminu's recent career. We got the Clippers. We got the Pelicans slash Hornets. We got the Mavericks, and we got the Raptors. I know he played for the Clippers. I know he played for the Clippers. I'm pretty sure he played for Charlotte. I mean, New Orleans. New Orleans, my bad. Dallas and Toronto, though. Dallas and Toronto is going to be a little bit of a mix-up. I want to say he played for Toronto and not Dallas. I want to say that. I think I'm going to say that, and it was the other way around. All right. All right, well, that, that one kind of stings, I'm not going to lie. Now we got one left, and we it's Kevin Durant with a minute 50 remaining. This one should be an easy one. We got Oklahoma City, Golden State, the Supersonics, and those cats. All right, you guys, with the final one, we are obviously going those cats. So we finish off the quiz with an 80% when the average score is a 61% for those who have taken this quiz. So not terrible by any stretch of the imagination, and 80% is still not as good as I wanted to get on this quiz. Don't get me wrong, you guys, when we were going through the actual players in this quiz, it was a lot more challenging than I expected from the very beginning. As we went through a lot of players who seemed to be middle of the pack players and kind of older players as well, I thought going into this quiz, it was going to be more of the realm of players in today's age that are actually pretty good right now or at least are in the middle of their career but we got a very interesting group of players for this quiz so an 80 percent i will take but again i'm gonna say that i wish i would have got better obviously if you guys decided to take this quiz with me along the way and you paused it before every single one and made your guess as well which i really hope you guys do when you're watching these let me know what you guys got on the quiz down below because i really do want to hear what you guys have to get on all these quizzes because i want to interact with you guys i want to know what you guys get on these quizzes with me i want to know if you beat me on these for that matter because it's always fun to hear what you guys are thinking of these quizzes and if you want to see more and if you guys have any any ideas for quizzes in the future make sure to leave your feedback on those down below as well i really do want to hear what you guys have to say and what you guys want to see on the channel but you guys have to go through that nba guess the team they did not play for quiz i'm thinking that's going to mark the end of the video here today once again i'm really hoping you guys did enjoy this video and if you did in any way shape or form please you guys i'm highly encouraging each and every one of you to go down below and slap a like on it for me you guys know how much the support means to me on the channel we are growing like crazy and as a matter of fact we just got partnered here on youtube and i truly cannot thank you guys enough because without you i would not have been able to achieve this goal of reaching a youtube partnership it truly does mean the world and trust me you guys this is only the beginning also if you guys are still here i actually just started my second channel today so if you have any time or you are interested in any way make sure to go down below and hit the link or the link to my second channel will be at the end of this video that channel will be focused mainly on gaming nba 2k madden ncaa football whatever you guys want to see i will be doing on that second channel so if you guys have any time or you seem interested at all make sure to go subscribe but after making that final comment you guys that is the last thing i had to say on my mind so once again i thank you guys so much for watching i love each and every one of you guys you all know this and never forget it and i will see you all in the next video peace